Chicago. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Wow. This is going to be awesome. The pick is in. The Chicago Bears, who have traded up to make a play, have drafted. <laughs> wow. Justin oh, wow. Fields. Wow. Holy Woo. shit. Justin Fields, for about 10 years now, oh. has been considered the number two prospect coming out of this draft class. Trevor Lawrence was always going to be number one. That was just kind of how it was. Justin Fields always had a battle in his shadow, whether it was Elite 11 camps, recruiting camps, seven on sevens, you name it, which, by the way, he was in Cam Newton's team, I believe, so everybody thought there was a chance he was yep. going to go to New England. Now, he has fallen out of the top five, out of the top ten, and now the Chicago Bears bring in Justin Fields, Woo! a team that has a beautiful history of not elite quarterback play, hope, hopes that – Justin Fields will be able to add a different dimension up there alongside Andy fucking Dalton, dude. And with the thought that Aaron Rodgers might be out of town, Mad Mel Kuyper, your thoughts immediately upon hearing about this. Very happy for Chicago. Justin Fields was my number two rated quarterback this entire time. Didn't really know why he was slipping. Maybe it was because, you know, Dan Orlovsky was saying Whoa. he wasn't very good. I don't know. I'm Whoa. not saying that. He is my Whoa. colleague. But Whoa. I am very excited to see what Justin Fields is able to do. Uh, I'm really looking forward to how he performs in year two under a new coach and new GM because those guys are still getting shit canned next oh, year. Okay, okay. Uh, so, mm -hmm. hey, you know, hats off to the Bears. This is the kind of play they needed to do. But, you know, you really got to feel bad for Andy Dalton. They dangle a carrot in front of him. Hey, you're going to start. You're going to start. Boom! You're sitting on the bench. We drafted your replacement. Sorry, Andy. And if Justin Fields gets hurt and you go out there and you get decapitated, your teammates aren't going to help you up just like last year in uh, <laughs> Dallas. And you won't have – you will have an indoor practice facility unlike your time at Cincinnati when you won there too. Andy Dalton uh, did sign – in a much different predicament than it currently is. A.J. Hawk, Ohio State legend. Justin Fields, Ohio State stud. There was a lot of stories coming out. Who's going to do what? How's it going to pan out? Mac Jones still on the board. Justin Fields, now a Chicago Bear. Your thoughts? Well, we, we mentioned earlier today, actually, on your show, that, hey, the Bears are going to have to sell out. They're going to have to do – we know their head coach and GM both could be fired, you know, mid mid-season. So, yeah. But is Justin Fields going to get plugged in right away? That's the question. Like, do they plan on him being day one starter? Well, Nagy, right, in pace, do they think, like, you know what, we can have, like, uh, you know, since 17-game season, we can yeah. go eight, nine games and just kind of – they have to assume that they're potentially getting fired. Now, this is – that was a lot of draft picks, okay? That was a lot to get up there. Um, and, and, by the way, pro football focus guy uh, this morning was right – said watch Chicago, get, uh -huh. you know, get a shout out to him saying watch Chicago earlier. So here we go. They wanted Russell Wilson. They flew out to Fargo, North Dakota, tried to get Russell Wilson. Their fan base thought they were getting Russell Wilson. Then all of a sudden, Andy Dalton's dropped in there. I was thought I was a starter. They come out and say, Andy Dalton's a starter. Now here we are trading away the entire farm, barn, and hen house to get up to 11 to get Justin Fields. If it works out, it works out. If not, they're fired. That's probably how they feel in that war room. Congrats to Justin Fields getting drafted. I love that it's uh, at number 11. We all thought it was going to be top five. There was a long draft cycle for Justin Fields. A lot of bullshit being said. Here he is in Chicago. I hope he can be the star of the Midway. Oh, yeah. Bingo. That's there Chicago. It is. Well oh, H. There it is. Well said. Uh, there, boy. Oh, yeah. H. Yeah. Oh, H. Oh, listen to Zito. Wow. Oh, Zito. I owe to Zito for sure. Oh, no. Fuck. No, that was too late. Go to hell. You said it to me. You said that to me. <laughs> you said that to Pat. You said that to me. You said that to Pat. No, said, I absolutely did not. Yeah, you lost 20000 and you said, oh, yeah. <laughs> so I mean, what it's tough to take you serious in your tank top and your uh, <laughs> your bow tie. This is Tuxedo Formal, Come on, Bob, dude. Down here at Tampa Bay FanDuel Beach House. By the way, hashtag Draft Spectacular on Twitter. Hashtag SeatGeek is back. They'll be picking, I think, two random winners and giving season tickets to their favorite NFL team to them since SeatGeek survived that. Uh, congrats to Justin Fields. Yeah. Dude. Zito, I hope you get a chance to get season tickets to go watch this. This could be the comeback of a beautiful thing. Tyree Cohen's there. They franchise tagged Allen Robinson. The defense is still the defense. Are the Chicago Bears back since Aaron Rodgers is potentially out of town? Guess who's back? Back again. Maybe the Bears. Hell yeah. But then again, maybe not. Yeah, nope. they, they could still stink. Uh, coach stinks. GM probably stinks. But uh, do you think, I mean, is it safe to assume that Justin Fields is going to start from day one? Yeah, I, yeah that's what we got. That's what AJ I mean, has. they just traded the goddamn farm yeah, for him. Yeah, he has to. Yeah. Especially they don't if they want to keep their job. Who has time Who I, has time to let him develop? I think what the owner said to Pace and Nagy is, I wish you had <laughs> more time. Name that movie, AJ. Huh? Um, Name that movie. Come dude. on, dude. Who you says it? it? Fucking Denzel Washington. Mm -hmm. 
Is that the one where he's going to shoot himself to save his kid? No, no. That's John Q, for Christ's sake. Come on, you John got Q, this one. The, hey, whenever, whenever the kid goes under the barrier as he's driving away in the back of the thing and the kid starts posing, oh, oh. waterfalls. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Waterfalls out of me. I can't watch it ever again. I ain't ever going to cry to a movie ever again, but that one got me. This one, obviously, is when he's going to try to kill everybody. Yeah, come on, dude. And that's what he does. Denzel Washington was killing everybody. He was on the hood of a car, actually, when he told him this. Yep. It's a uh, man on fire. Yep. There John 